Hey everyone, welcome to this video. My name is Nikhil and in this video we are going to talk about what are the most common reason why Facebook has rejected your uh, Facebook ads or disabled your Facebook account or your Facebook page or your Facebook ID. What are the most common reason or most common mistakes uh, people make uh, so that their you know accounts get rejected so this is what we are going to understand so that you can avoid those mistakes next time and if your facebook ad account is disabled how you can recover that ad account we have already created a video you know uh, the previous video you can check that video out and i'll also put a link in the description of this video you can check that video uh, try and recover your facebook ad account but in this video we are going to understand the most common reason why facebook ad accounts get rejected or ads get rejected okay so let's say once your ad is rejected uh, which i have an example of if you see this is the ad one of the video ad which got rejected and if i hover my mouse here on the delivery it gives me this option go to account quality so once i go to account quality it will bring me to this window and here you know i can request a review a manual review of that particular ad okay if you think your ad is rejected by mistake sometimes what happens is that uh, facebook algorithm also flags the ad and those ads get rejected okay and uh, once you request a manual review they go through the you know approval process so uh, do request a review if that's the case uh, what policy was violated you will see that option you know under policy violation here it will not give you a exact reason why your facebook ad was rejected but a, which policy was violated so that you can understand uh, what is the mistake you have done in that particular ad or you know uh, what are the common mistakes you have done so you can check that a uh, policy violation from here uh, so yeah that's how you can you know uh, recover or request a review for your ad now let's understand what are the most common reason i have seen that you know number of time people making these mistakes for example i came across a lot of such videos where people have created videos on how you can promote your youtube videos through facebook ads now they show the process but the mistake they do is that in the landing page url option they directly put the youtube link okay and people who are watching the video they do the same thing and that's the most common mistake people make facebook doesn't want that and it is going to reject your ad immediately if you try and promote your uh, youtube uh, you know uh, videos link directly from facebook ad that's one of the most common mistake in in fact not just youtube videos uh, you know if you are promoting your telegram groups direct affiliate links also directly from the ads uh, that is also one of the most common reasons so now there are ways how you can do this uh, by you know uh, creating a proper landing page and then uh, you know adding one extra step and then promoting your videos or uh, telegram groups that's the way to do it if you directly do it facebook is not gonna like that and it is going to reject so please do not trust any or every information out there on you know facebook ads that's what i would uh, directly recommend you then another thing which i've uh, seen is that uh, people try to run the ads on a dummy business which means it's not an actual business they just for uh, you know their own understanding how facebook ads work they just try and run the ads then also if you're not using legitimate ads or uh, landing pages uh, Facebook is going to reject your ads too. Then another most common reason is that if you are using copyrighted images or uh, images with a you know a water mark on it uh, or videos on a, uh, with a water mark on it, then also likely your Facebook ad uh, or ad account is going to be disabled because of just or because of that one reason. So try and run the ads for real business proper business try and generate uh, the leads for proper or real businesses uh, do that practice that way uh, that is what i would suggest you so other common reasons uh, you know what you can do is you can just directly go to google and search for fb ad policy here and if you go with the first organic link meta advertising policies what it is going to show you it is going to take you to these you know uh, this document here now this is 
uh, one of the most important document i would actually uh, you know uh, recommend every advertiser every facebook advertiser to read this document once at least once so that you have understanding what are the common mistake you actually do in fact when you go to account quality you click on the policy violation also it will take you to this particular document only what are the policy you have violated okay in my case uh, it was use of brand assets i was talking too much about facebook ad and hence the ad was rejected please check these things you know prohibited content restricted content all of these things under prohibited these are the most common mistake uh, people make i'm not going to walk you through all of these but if you see uh, you know what are the most common one are this uh, third party infringement uh, which i just talked to you about that do not use the images or copyrighted images or videos avoid those things uh, misleading claims you know that's that's also another one uh, which people use so for example you give guarantees to people like if you take this course you are going to make millions of dollars or you know thousands of dollars so that's a claim you know that's a guarantee you are giving facebook doesn't like that okay please avoid those things uh, try and uh, you know write your copies uh, around all of these things do not directly claim everything for example let's say you are a coaching institute and uh, for example iit coaching institute or a neat coaching coaching institute and you directly say that uh, you know if you take this course you are sure to get uh, first rank in iit now that's a very misleading statement here you cannot make those claims according to facebook uh, the only way to do this is to work around your copies uh, around these statements and do not directly say that you are going to get the first rank okay so this is one of the most common mistake people make uh, in the facebook ad and there are many others you can check out all of these you know and see in which segment your ad was falling which got rejected and how you can avoid that next time so i hope you understood this video go through this doc i'll put the link in the description itself uh, check out this doc and understand everything also don't forget to like this video subscribe to the channel if you like the video and i'll meet you in the next video very soon thank you so much bye bye